Good day, Leo, and welcome to my channel. This is your monthly reading for September 2024. If you're new here, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. I hope you're all doing well, and I hope this reading resonates with you. Universe speak. Spirit's guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? Seven of Hearts, Six of Hearts, Ten of Hearts, and the Nine of Hearts. Lots of water energy here. Wow. Okay. So, uh, your general energy is the Nine of Hearts, a wish fulfilled. Love, happiness, joy, and all the good stuff is yours, uh, provided that you count your blessings, uh, that you see the blessings that you already have. Uh, by doing so uh, and celebrating that, celebrating your, our, the blessings you already have, is going to bring you more blessings, more happiness, more love, more joy, um, all the good stuff. Um, now, a lot of people, you know, are like, well, what blessings? I'm, I'm not blessed, blah, 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 blah. Uh, well, we're all blessed. Uh, everybody's got blessings. Uh, do you have a roof over your head? Do you have food in your belly? Uh, are your kids doing good? Maybe you got a good job, uh, whatever. Uh, these are blessings, you know, uh, and everybody's got them. Even, even homeless people have blessings. Uh, I've been homeless, uh, and I was blessed with soup kitchens, and I was blessed with shelters and stuff like that. Uh, you know, food pantries and all that good stuff. Uh, so everybody does have blessings. Uh, you just need to look for them sometimes. Uh, and sometimes you don't have to look for them at all. Uh, but by being grateful and celebrating your blessings, you will get a wish fulfillment of more blessings, more love, more happiness, more joy. At the beginning of the uh, month, you have the seven of hearts. You need to stop. You're doing too damn much. You're either doing too much at work or you're doing too much for somebody or some people. Uh, but either way, you're doing too much and you need to cut that fat off and rethink your priorities because your priorities are hurting because you've been doing so much for others. You need to focus on number one, okay? And you need to focus on each priority one at a time. Finish a priority and start on the next priority and move on. But yeah, you've been doing too much for other people and you need to cut off that fat. Regardless if it hurts somebody or if even it hurts you to cut this person off or to cut this whatever the you're doing too much of. Uh, it, it might hurt, but you know, you need to focus on number one. You need to focus on you. Uh, in the middle of the uh, month, you have the six of hearts. Okay, so a past love is coming in. This doesn't have to be a lover. This can be a friend or a family member. Uh, this is just somebody that you had or have a love for. Um, and the relationship just didn't work out right. Okay, uh, now you can go ahead and let this person back in. Uh, now, but the cards are saying, don't, don't repeat this. Cause that's what it's going to be. It's going to be a repeat. Um, now you may have, uh, contacted them or they may have contacted you, or maybe you bumped into each other at the grocery store, but regardless, uh, they have came back into your life in some sort of way. Uh, but yeah, the cards say, don't do it. Cause it's going to be a repeat. Even if you think they've changed or if you can't quite remember why, uh, you guys separated in the first place. It doesn't matter because it's going to happen the same way again. You're going to go through the same issues. It's going to end the same, if not worse. They might end even worse than it did before. And uh, yeah, I mean, it might it might work out for a week. It might work out for a month. Hell, it might work out for a year with this person. But you're going to go through the same you know, ter turmoil that you went with them before. Uh, so it's totally up to you. This is just advice, right? Uh, at the end of the uh, month, Ten of Hearts, happiness, abundance, success. You're going to be very satisfied um, at the end of the um, month. And I feel like this has a lot to do with, like, you being grateful for the blessings you already have and you focusing on number one and you possibly not letting this person back into your life. But of course you could. Uh, but regardless, I think this, it, it's all leading. I mean, look at it. It's all hearts, man. 
It is all hearts. So, I mean, regardless, this is going to be a great month for you. It's going to be a very happy, prosperous, loving, uh, joyful time for you. Uh, regardless if you're going to hurt because you got to cut somebody off or cut something off uh, to focus on number one. Even if it hurts not letting somebody back into your life, it doesn't matter because you're... You, you're, you're I'm feeling a lot of blessings here. I feel like you have a lot of blessings. Maybe you're not seeing it, uh, but there are. You have blessings. Uh, I feel like there's a lot of love around you. Um, now, that comes in many different forms, you know, love. Uh, that can come from just total strangers just loving you. You know, it doesn't have to be family. It doesn't have to be a friend. Uh, it doesn't have to be a lover. It can just be people that uh, gravitate you and enjoy your energy. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like you have that. You have that energy where people enjoy being around you. They they genuinely love you, you know. Uh, so, yeah, really, really great, uh, really great month here. I mean, you got some stuff to do, but... Really great month. Let's go ahead and check out the tarot cards. Universe Speak. Spirit's Guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? Oh, wow. Okay, so you got the Ace of Cups, right? And in the Ace of Cups, this this cup is overfilled, right? It's it's overfilled, and that that's just that's what I'm feeling for you this month, is that your cup is going to be overfilled, and you should go right the hell ahead and continue to overfill it. Uh, it's going to be overfilled with love, happiness, and joy. Plain and simple. I mean, yeah. So. Yeah, I I just really feel like this is going to be a really great month for you, uh, regardless of the things that you have to do in order to make it a really good month for you. But I don't think it's going to be that hard for you to stop doing so damn much and focusing on number one. I don't think it's going to be hard for you to see the blessings that you have and being grateful for them and celebrating them. You know, I don't, I just don't, I think that it's going to be kind of an easy uh, month for you, honestly. So there you go. I I really hope this uh, resonates, and if it does, hit that like button, and if you would, please comment, share, and subscribe. I hope to see you back here next month, and until then, stay safe, stay mindful, and stay healthy.